Welcome back to Spore and Sprout. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to make a spore syringe. This will come in handy if you find a wild mushroom and you want to cultivate it yourself. You can take it home and take a spore print of it and then make your own spore syringe. This is fairly easy and you only need a few things. A small shot glass or a small cup. A sterile knife, isopropyl alcohol, paper towels, a spore print, and sterilized water, and a sterilized syringe and needle. So after you wipe everything down with isopropyl alcohol, you want to use your sterile knife to scratch the spore print to release the spores. And then dump them into your shot glass or your small cup. In this example, I'm going to be making a syringe from a wild elm oyster mushroom, and the spore print was white, so that's why you can't really see anything on the tin foil. Now that you have scraped your spore print into a shot glass or a small container, it's time to take your syringe and suck up some sterile water. So the final step is to spray the sterile water into the shot glass of spores and then you can suck it up and then spray it out. And if you do that a few times, it helps mix up the solution. On the last draw up, make sure there's no air bubbles in the syringe. You can tilt it upward and then push out the air through the top and then you can put your black cap onto the syringe and then you can store it or you can use it immediately. And that's all there is to it. Now you know how to make a spore syringe. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this one.